Fred, good morning to you. Yeah, it's very impressive. Take a look. A tree on top of their two vehicles here on uh, B Bobby Lane near Beach uh, Drive here in uh, Decatur. Quite the mess this homeowner is dealing with. You can see up high it appears as if the lines are on top of uh, the tree is on top of the lines there. I want to take a walk over here because this is a massive tree. This is really what we've seen all over this neighborhood, although this homeowner will tell you here in just a second that he believes that his home, uh, their home was hit the hardest in this area. I'm going to uh, bring in Daniel Hedges. Daniel, this is your home. You and your wife are out here trying to get what you can out of the home. Man, what did you see? What did you hear? Uh, we heard a rumble and it, nothing felt comfortable. So both of us uh, ran and grabbed a child and ran out front door to the neighbors and realized what has happened. And I think uh, we, we definitely have a blessing that everybody got out okay. Man, quite a mess there. So everybody got out safe. You tell me that the homeowner behind you actually got entrapped in their home? Uh, I don't know about that, but I just walked over there and their house is, you can't see their house. Um, it's, it's three big trees fell onto their house and into their yard. Uh, so there's, there's quite a bit of damage to just these two houses alone. Um, and you believe your house may have gotten hit the hardest? No, I'm not sure about that. I think Jim behind me might have got hit a little bit harder. Isn't that something? Yeah. Yeah. My goodness. We heard of at least one entrapment uh, in the neighborhood where firefighters had to rescue two people. We understand that they are okay, so okay, it may have been that, that home. That was Jim and Jackie then. Yeah. Isn't that something? My so goodness. The, when we talked to the, the, the fire department, they said that it wasn't a tornado, that it was a microburst. And it sounded like a tornado, which is why we grabbed the kids. It was a very, very intense rumble lots of rain and then we could just hear branches falling and the roar and just ran and then the trees just and it was over within about 11 seconds I'll tell you, just a miracle that you're okay you gave me some pictures of your home on the inside i'm going to put those for the folks online but again uh, quite the mess here they're lucky that they got alive uh, got out with their lives this morning of course we'll be in the neighborhood today taking a look at more of the damage i'll have another live update for you coming up at 6 55 we're live this morning in DeKalb county daniel wilkerson cbs 46 news Man, those pictures are really